rock and learn. Let's play a game. I'll list some characteristics of an animal group, and you tell me if that is the group you belong to. All of the animals in this group have an exoskeleton. They have segmented bodies and jointed legs. All of them are cold-blooded. The body temperature of a cold-blooded animal is dependent on the temperature of its environment. Do you belong to this group? No, I don't have an exoskeleton. But I do. Correct. That group of animals is called arthropods. And that includes butterflies. Okay, second round. Listen closely. All of the animals from this group are vertebrates, which means they have a spine. They have gills for breathing underwater. Most of the animals in this group are covered in scales and have fins. Do you belong to this group? Well, I do have a backbone, but I don't have gills. No, I don't belong in that group. Great job! That group of animals is called fish. Okay, next round. Listen closely. All of the animals from this group begin life with gills and live in water. Later, they develop lungs and live on land. They have moist, hairless skin. All of them are cold-blooded and they lay their eggs in water. Do you belong to this group? No, I've got quite a bit of hair on my head. <laughs> oh, Kevin, you're good at this game. That group of animals is called amphibians. Now remember, I list the characteristics and you determine if you belong to that group. Are you ready? I'm ready. All of the animals from this group are vertebrates. These animals lay their eggs on land and they have scales. All of them are cold-blooded. Do you belong to this group? No, I'm not cold-blooded. My temperature stays around 98.6 degrees. Hooray! You're right again! That group of animals is called <laughs> reptiles. Okay, this list is a little longer. Are you ready? Sure, I can do it. All of the animals from this group are warm-blooded vertebrates. They breathe air and they are bipedal. That means they walk on two legs. Like you. Ahem. The animals in this group also lay hard-shelled eggs. And all of them have feathers, wings, and beaks. Do you belong to this group? Wow, as you were reading that first part, I thought that was going to be it. But when you got to the end, I don't have feathers, wings, or a beak. Whew, that was a close one. That group of animals is called birds. Now I think you're ready for a real challenge. I'm ready. All of the animals from this group are warm-blooded vertebrates. They breathe air and have hair or fur. Most of the animals in this group are born live, not hatched from an egg. And the mothers produce milk after birth to feed their offspring. All of these animals have three middle ear bones and a four-chambered heart in their circulatory system. Do you belong to this group? That's it! That's the group I belong to! You are a mammal! We have a winner! A winner? What do I win? What do I win? You win a new card! Really? <laughs> wow! Not old enough to drive? We'll keep the car for you until you get your license. <laughs>